what's up guys camp and russia here welcome back everybody to another rocket league video today we're looking at the rocket league roadmap for spring of 2018 now sorry this came out about five or six hours ago i'm uh i'm definitely late to it uh i had some class to go to today unfortunately that i literally could not miss else i would have missed it um so sorry i'm a little bit late but there is too much exciting stuff within this post not to talk about this is a big move on uh on psionics's part and there's a lot of information to be had here so i'm gonna try and make it quick and uh, this will be the sole purpose of the video today no gameplay just so i can get it up there and uh if you haven't heard about it already here you'll get the info so basically i'll sum sum up the start here we're testing out a new update uh testing out a new update schedule this year that alternates content updates uh which includes things like competitive seasons rewards maps events and dlc with feature updates that focus on new functionality uh, like tournaments or cross-platform parties. So they, they want to alternate. They want to go back and forth between content and feature. And, and we've talked about this. We could kind of see this happening over the, the last couple months. So with that in mind, they are now going to highlight what is ahead in the, in the coming months. So let's look at February because February is tomorrow. And, uh, and we already know a little bit. But February content update competitive season seven begins competitive season six rewards new crate and a new a new rlcs fan rewards rlcs fan rewards baby that's pretty huge man we didn't know two of those things we knew the new uh, season was coming and this one was ending and the new crate we had no idea was coming out new rlcs fan rewards uh is something new we're gonna have a, a new version of the apex wheels who knows if does that mean the Apex wheels are going to be gone forever? I have no idea, man. We were also told a while back regarding crates, items, etc. I think about a month ago that uh, one of the developers, I forget, one of you know, Corey uh, or who was it, Devin, one of the one, one of the developers or someone at Psionics confirmed that new mystery decals are coming. And in my mind, with the new crate coming and new RLCS fan rewards coming there 100% has to be a new mystery decal coming, I think. With the confirmation, with the amount of feedback, like, we could, uh, you know, and further down we'll read, we could tell they're listening to feedback. Um, and so they've not only been listening to good feedback, they've confirmed that they've heard and are going to be taking action on this specific feedback with the mystery decal. I, I, I don't see a world where we do not see a mystery decal in seven days, which is so exciting, man. I think everyone's just waiting for it. We want a new MD, a new black market mystery decal. So I think we can see that coming. Whether it'll be in the new RLCS fan reward or the crate, uh, obviously we could probably assume the crate, but hey, maybe they'll switch it up and put it in the fan reward. What's your thoughts on that? Do you think it's coming? Tournaments beta, uh, Steam public beta for our upcoming tournaments feature. So they're really they've 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 set another date on it here uh not an official date but within february we are supposed to see a beta so hopefully they can pull through on that uh as uh they fell short a couple times on the tournament beta uh, and i just want to see it man i want i want to use it i want to play with it march new license premium dlc and the spring event which is super exciting we got another event coming in march so right there uh, the two next months are exciting in rocket league spring feature update march to april tournaments quality of life updates such as item stacking better item filtering searching and sorting equipped to blue slash orange team for painted car bodies man these guys do listen to us eh? <laughs> that's really good news to see the item stacking oh my god would that help man that would be awesome uh and then just some some other uh general changes that'll improve the quality of life man new and expanded options uh packets send slash receive rate and bandwidth limits Team quick chat only, another good one we've talked about. Disable one minute remaining, etc. Messages if you want to. I I I don't I don't think that's a big one, but some people may. Connection quality info, um, uh, basically improving connection quality and switch performance and visual quality updates for the Nintendo Switch. April and beyond. Once the tournament is released and working, uh, that's when they'll they're going to be doing more posts like these every few months. We're going to see a uh, you know a summer summer 2018 roadmap um again and, and that is is assumed to come out just after the tournaments the tournaments is like the big thing once that is handled and dealt with um and, and out there and people are using it then they can move on to their next their next big goal right their next big update so uh which is understandable man this tournament thing sounds huge and i can't wait for it cross-platform parties 
uh, that are still being, and these are the things that are still being developed for 2018 release. So within 2018, cross-platform parties, that would be huge, man. I have so many buddies that play on PS4 or, or Xbox, and I can't play with them, man, because I'm on PC. That's going to be huge. Progression updates makes make XP relevant again. Earn dec decryptors through play and new banners, titles, and other rewards for reaching high levels. New arenas, new features, and support for the Xbox One X is uh, is planned for late 2018. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That's just a quick look at the major highlights that are coming up this year. And look out for the February update next week, pending first-party certification approvals when it launches on all platforms February 7th. So what does that mean? Well, I'll tell you what I think that means. February 7th, a week from now, the new season's going to come. This season's obviously going to end. New rewards will be here. I think we're going to be getting the new crate that day. And I also think they're going to announce the RLCS rewards that day. I think February 7th is going to be a hype day, man. And I cannot wait. I, I can't wait, dude. Like, it's so, you know, the, the Cyanox has been a little quiet over the last couple months. And they've kind of said why. It's been the holidays, etc. And they're working hard on some things. So to see... To, to get this from Psyonix, I think, is a huge deal, man. It's just, it, it makes me feel good, just as a player of the game, part of the community, and uh, I'm sure a lot of you are feeling this way as well. It just, it feels good to know what's going on, you know what I mean? Whether, whether uh, you know, it's what we want to hear or not, in this case for me, like, this all sounds like good stuff. I'm happy, but maybe some of this stuff disappoints you a little bit, but uh, I think you can say, at least, it, it's good to be informed, right? It's good to know, and, and I think... Psyonix has made a really big play here, uh, outlining everything, because that's, like they said in the post a day or two ago, it's a risky thing to do, because now they have expectations, and if they let us down on any of these, there will be negative backlash from the community, so... It's not easy for them to do this. It's a risky way of doing things for them, but I appreciate the risk, man, and I'm happy to, to know what's going on. So uh, that's all I got. I, I, I want to get this video up pretty quick for you guys. Again, I, I'm a little late already today, so uh, I do want to just shoot this up as fast as possible, so no gameplay. What do you guys think of, dude? This new, what do you guys think is coming in the new crate? New RLCS rewards? What are we going to see? Like, this is, uh, we'll be anticipating some big news here over the, over the coming days, man. I'm excited. And honestly, I'm just so happy I have my GC rewards, man. We, you have seven days left. Like, theoretically, like, I, because look, go down in the comments here quickly before we head off. I read a comment. Um, is this, is this the sneakiest way of all time to reveal the, that the season ends February 7th? Psionix Devin replied with a smiley face, which I believe means season seven is ending, uh, or season seven's coming on, uh, on the seventh. Is it season seven? Season ends on the seventh, whatever it may be. So make sure you grind out your rewards. You got seven days left to do it. Do your thing, man. I believe in you, man. I believe in you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching today's video. There will be another video up tonight. It'll be Fortnite. Um, and make sure to check that out if you want to. Touch that like button if you enjoyed and are excited. Join the Rushers by subscribing to keep up to date with all the Rocket League news and, uh, and for Fortnite videos every day. Take care. Have a good one. Talk soon. Uh, goodbye.